so it's June 10th and where are we? DD. What's DD? Diamond Direct. <laughs> We're gonna go ring shopping. I made it! I made it! <laughs> this is what dreams Let's go, of. let's go. Hey now, hey now. I am so excited. So I was like, what does one wear when they go ring shopping? So I put this little number together. I was like, mm. housewife vibes, right? Except I have to go back. To, to except I'm going back to work tomorrow after like 12, 13 weeks off. Come on, Sorry, I'm just, I'm just giving an update, but life is good. What are you going to share this with? This is a personal memory, okay? You want to say something? Yeah, she was crazy back then, too. <laughs> just kidding. You know what you got yourself into. Love you. Oh my goodness, that was like the bougiest thing I've ever done in my entire life. Right, babe? That's right. <laughs> Our uh, diamond lady, Sylvia, could probably tell. Our diamond tell. lady. Yeah, what is she called? <laughs> no, we make it sound like we've got a diamond lady. We yeah. have a diamond lady. We had a, my baby is so sweet and made a personal appointment for us. So that's what I'm telling you. Most bougie thing I've done in my life up to this point, anyway. So yeah, that was a lot of fun. And they make you wear these masks in there the whole time. So that's why like my nose looks a little red because. My big old hunker was like rubbing against it. But um, wow, so I figured out I love the pear shape and it was pretty easy. So I have an idea of what I want and um, I'm really excited. Me too, you excited, babe? Wow, mama, I made it. It's Tuesday, January 4th, and I just got to my appointment to get my wedding dress fitted. My wedding dress has been in this box for like three to four months, okay? So I picked my wedding dress out back in July with my future mother-in-law and my mom in Rhode Island. It was a very special moment, and it's just been sitting in this box because they shipped it to me. I'm excited to see it. I'm getting married in less than four months. And my bachelorette is next month, so 2022 is already happening, okay? So it's Tuesday, January 18th, and I just got to my second dress fitting appointment. Yes, I have a second dress, okay? I know I am being bougie to the max, but I love this dress so much. I went with my girlfriend Alexis to Vowed, um, and I can't wait for you to see this dress. It just glistens under the light. It's so shimmery. Um, I love my first one, but this one is for the reception, but I need to get it altered. So I just got to David's bridal right now. And since they're altering my first dress, I'm just gonna have them alter my second dress. And yeah, we are in the double digits now. So things are happening. We are making plans. Um, my fiance and I, are making decisions we're in touch with the wedding coordinator now and it's just getting really exciting so i think we are about 96 days away from saying i do so whew, i'm so excited and i am so ready to be mrs clark so let's go get this dress altered and then we have to pick out wedding bands i almost have everything ready for my bachelorette party um, and then we just have to focus on welcome bags. So everything is just coming together nicely. I'm trying not to stress out. <laughs> We're filling out our marriage license application. So exciting. So it's Thursday, February 3rd, and I am at my second fitting for my first dress. I'm really excited to see how it fits. I can't wait. And then my second fitting for my second dress is in another week. So everything is coming together nicely. I'm so excited. 80 more days. And my bachelorette is in 22 days. So there are so many exciting things coming. 
2022 is the year. The dress fits perfect. I'm so in love. I'm so excited. So I just need to get a veil now. Um, I forgot to ask to try some on when I have the dress on in there right now. But I'm just gonna bring the dress back when I come back to get my second dress next week and get my veil then because it was just a whole ordeal hanging it up. So I'm just gonna come back next week and get the veil. I can order a veil on Etsy, but I feel like I need to try the veil on with my dress because I want it to be the perfect length. We're doing a test run for our welcome bags. This is our stamp that we had made. Custom stamp. This is the prototype. <laughs> How's it look? Oh. I think I need to get one more. Good thing we got an extra one, huh? That looks good. All right. No pressure. didn't work. We need to just make sure we get more ink. What the hell? Raggedy. We just got done stamping all of our bags and they look amazing. We had a little issues along the way because um, the stamp wasn't super opaque, but I think it looks great. They're not perfect, but we were saying that they look a little rustic, like you can see this little mark here, but other than that, we're so excited. It was a lot harder to stamp than we thought. We thought it was gonna be really easy, but um, thank goodness for my fiance because he had to apply a lot of pressure. I tried doing one and I just, yeah, they were horrible. These are all the bags. We're gonna go get more because we had to throw some out. So we're like short five. Our welcome bags look so good. So, we got these airplane keychains to fill them with. We're gonna add an itinerary for the weekend. These are so cute. I'm not sure if I wanna, I think they would look cute like hung on the side of the bag, but I feel like it'll weigh it down. Um, and then we got a little ring pop for the ladies because we're gonna, uh, put a cigar in there for the men. And then of course we got a Clark bar. This was my fiance's idea. These are really good too. It's a Clark cup, sorry. So, delicious. So it's February 15th and that is what we have so far of our first dance. He's picking me up a lot, but I think we have a solid intro, so really excited. Ooh. Can we take it out? Yes, please. We gotta plug it in. Yeah, it looks so good. We got a remote so we can change the colors. It looks so cool. So the remote was an extra $50 to get the different colors, but definitely worth it. Otherwise it just would have been white. Sexy, I love it. It's great. It's Wednesday, February 16th, and we're going to pick up our wedding rings. Mm -hmm. It's been like, what, three weeks since we ordered yeah, them? Two, three. So I'm excited, and I got my hair did yesterday. Awesome. Looks so good. <laughs> We just picked him up. I love it so, so much. Let me show you. So I have an appointment on April 8th to come back 
and get the ring soldered together because I put my engagement ring in the center, but it, it kind of moves around a little bit and I'm not gonna wear one without the other anyways. So um, the soonest same day appointment they have to do that is April 8th, which is perfect right before the wedding. The ring looks way prettier in person, I will say, and I do need to get a manicure, so don't mind that, but because you can see like the ring um, kind of has room to move right now. So that'll be fixed. I just wore it out today. <sighs> she bougie. This is his ring. It's a nice gold band. Thick, thick. Thick, thick. Our guest book just came in the mail today too, so. Lots of exciting things are happening. Whoops. So I thought that the cover was not gonna be um, paper like this, so that's a little disappointing, but my fiance isn't upset about it. And plus, I don't really mind the color of the actual book. It's like a nice pompous color, nice tan neutral. Um, but yeah, I'm a little disappointed with this um, but the book was very affordable it was about eighty dollars less than a hundred and the pages are really nice quality they're nice and thick so that's really nice and we just filled it with our engagement photos and we did every other page for our guests to sign i love the quality of the book um, the only disappointment is the cover, but again, that is fine. So this is going to be a great coffee table book for us to have forever. Why is there like white trim here? I just noticed that. Uh oh, it's not really, I didn't think there was going to be a white trim. Well, I just noticed an error, but it's fine. I don't really like how there's a white trim there and it's not consistent but whatever um here as well hmm let's see here yeah because it's not on the other side hmm. not there i oh, see not here either well anyways this is the book i'm glad there's no trim here it's perfect It's Thursday, February 17th. I just got to David's Bridal to pick up my second wedding dress. I brought my first dress with me because I forgot to try on a veil with it when I picked it up. And I'm most likely gonna order a veil on Etsy because they're way more affordable than David's Bridal. The ones I was looking at at David's Bridal were like three to 400, maybe even $500. So the ones I saw on Etsy, not only are they cheaper, but they're a lot nicer in my opinion they're more my style so um i think i'm gonna order a veil on etsy and i think i can get one under a hundred dollars so that's a really good deal i'm gonna try some on today to see what it looks like and to get an idea of how long it actually needs to be because i know i want a long veil um but i just need to try a long one on with this dress which i haven't done yet so i'm so excited 66 more days we have our wedding rings we almost have everything for our gift bags we just got our guest book in the mail yesterday and yeah everything is just coming together nicely let's go try it on i'm so excited to see it Good morning, it's March 4th, about nine in the morning, and we are on our way to- Don't get married. Yay. We're going to the courthouse right now. We're on our way to pick up Alexis, and Chris's friend Hunter is gonna meet us there. They're gonna be our witnesses. So, shh, this is top secret. We can't let anyone know, because our real date is April 24th. So, we just have to legally get married today. Um, because we're having a destination wedding. So, I'm just vlogging it. So excited. You look nice, babe. That's the jacket he wore in our engagement. 
picks and then I haven't worn this dress yet. It's like a white corset dress. A little chilly today, but the weather's not too bad. And then after we're gonna go get breakfast. Breakfast? Which I'm really excited for and I can't wait to put my wedding ring on, but I'm gonna take it off right after. Um, I'm not gonna, I'm gonna have it on all day, but I'm not gonna take any pictures wearing it. I'm just excited to wear my wedding ring because it's so beautiful. I'm excited to see you in your wedding ring too. <laughs> So right now we're going to the suit store to see if they have the one that Chris needs for the wedding. Um, but yeah, I wore my Tiffany's necklace for something blue. Um, something old is this watch that Chris got me like two birthdays ago. My uh, Michael Kors watch and then something new. It's like my whole outfit practically. And then I switched rings with Alexis to do something borrowed, um, but we already switched back. We have like the same Cartier ring, so. Yep, I had the something new, old, borrowed, and blue. So we're married now, my hubby. Baby, my wifey. <laughs> wifey for wifey. 